Linda Cari. Mr. President, members of the European Commission, experts from all four corners of the world in VET have come here today, as well as people from the community colleges in the Basque Country. So welcome to all of you. Good morning. It's great that we can actually be all here together today. Thank you so much to all of you who have come to the Basque Country to participate here, for having made the effort to come here. I'd like to say thanks to all our ex the experts here. All a fruitful stay with us. Please enjoy your visit to Donostia San Sebastián and the Congress. Es un verdadero honor contar con su presencia. It really is an honor to have you here today at the Basque Country between today and tomorrow, around 400 people from VED from 23 different countries will be participating. And they will be analyzing mainly the way human beings should evolve if they're going to face these unprecedented changes in our lives and the role of VET in a digitalized world. I'm just going to say a few words now. We've organized this event with a great deal of joy, and I'm sure that all of you that take part will be able to learn, to teach, and to all make your contributions. At least that's our hope. Occasionally, it's necessary to take a step back and to start uh, thinking about whether the road that we're following is the right one, whether we're taking the right path. And I actually think, yes, we are. But we need to think about whether certain changes might be necessary. And that's why we propose that we use local experiences and more innovative experiences from another way to try to think about all of this. Different ways of thinking will enrich us. Previous conferences organized by the Basque government concentrated on, for example, the fourth industrial revolution, the progress of technology and AI, and highlighted the new jobs of the future. This year, this international summit has taken a step further and we'll be thinking about how how human beings should be in the future within a context of technological revolution. I, what should be the development of human beings when facing the changes up ahead? Technology is, of course, progressing, but we need to use this technology properly. We need to make as much use of that technology as we can so that we can change things change things in a way that support people. We need to care for humans. This is something that's really important today. So I wish you all the best and let's get to work. Thank you.